What issues need to be considered in the early stage of the relay system construction? Frequency selection. Equipment selection. Antenna position selection. Repeater and antenna distance. Estimated system call distance. How to choose the frequency? First the repeater is not a personal device. Befuse, you need to report to the local radio committee. When reporting, the radio committee will give you a small range of frequencies. Let you choose one or several frequency points. Use these frequencies to use the repeater legally. Note, the frequency range selected by the radio commission, generally at both ends of UHF, is not commonly used frequency. This is to avoid affecting the use of popular frequency points. For example, in various regions of the U.S. a comic question FCC is a new .h.f comic question the available frequency segments are available between 440 and 450 mhz. You can see a lot on this website. LevineCentral.com slash repeaters slash google underscore mapping dot php. So before customizing the repeater comma question be sure to consult and report to the local radio committee first. If you want to build a GMRS repeater, the frequency of the GMRS repeater is fixed, as shown in the figure. The center frequency of the repeater should be lower frequency simplex repeater output, MHZ, 462.625 MHz. Upper frequency, repeater input, MHZ, 467.625 MHz. This frequency point is the center value of the eight channels of the GMRS. Each repeater is allowed to float one MHZ above and below its center frequency. Using 462.625 MHz and 467.625 MHz as the center value of the repeater. Any of the eight channels can be used. What equipment is the best? There are many brands of radio repeaters, Motorola, Hanga, Retavis. Repeater can be divided into digital truck, analog trunk. There are also many latitude classification methods. Which is the best? People here often enter a misunderstanding. Just at the time of purchase. To pay too much attention to performance parameters. Inspirational to get the best repeater. But buying a repeater doesn't just need to consider the performance of the repeater. But what should be considered is what effect do I want to achieve? What are the effects of these features? As long as the purchased repeater has these functions, it can be used as an alternative target. There are a lot of walkie-talkies. Many functions. But not every function you need. But buy him. Need to pay for all the features. The purchase price is also an important indicator we have chosen. Within the acceptable range of prices. Choosing electrical appliances. This way you can purchase enough features to use. The quality is very good. The price is still low. Good radio repeater.